Well, last year, a storm shortened alligator hunting season in Louisiana, but now the big gators are back and more brash than ever. And the stars of history, swamp people, really have their hands full. That includes Troy Landry. He spent the last three decades earning his reputation as king of the swamp. Hi there, Troy. Hey, good morning, Miss Mary. How are you doing? Hey, we're doing great. It's so nice to see you. Uh, so are you back with Clint this season? No, uh, I'm going to fish. I'm going to start off with my little nephew, and then I'm going to fish with my oldest son, Brandon, and my little brother jumps in for a couple of days. That's great. And I heard you, are you do you have an extra boat going then? Uh, Jacob. Jacob and his little brother Chase yeah. is going to be fishing this year. That's perfect. Uh, this season, how does it rank compared to past seasons for you? Well, this year we did real well. Uh, we didn't have any hurricanes, any bad storms uh, right before or during the season, so it actually made it a lot easier for us. Uh, uh, the first day of the season, I think we caught, like between Jacob and I, we caught 76 of them. So, uh, you know, with no storms, we come out the gate real strong and we caught some nice gators, caught some big alligators. We got, uh, got a lot of good footage for this year, a lot of real good footage. How aggressive are these gators? Can you put that into perspective for us? You know, every one of them alligators we catch are different. They all have different attitudes. Some of them are like big sissies, there's nothing to them. <laughs> and okay. others are so mean and they try to bite the boat. Well, they do bite the boat. They mm -hmm. try to bite you. Uh, some of them are real, real aggressive and real mean. You'd swear to God they have rabies or something. They're so, <laughs> some of them are so mean, but uh, they're all different. Every Troy. one of them is different and until you pick up that line, you don't know what's don't on know. the other end. I don't mean to laugh, but you say some of the funniest things. Um, so what are the greatest challenges for you being out there? Do you think it's the people, uh, the gators, the elements? What is it? Well, my biggest challenge for me being out there is my age. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a spring chicken no more, and it looks yeah. like it looks like every year it keeps getting a little bit harder for me and a little bit harder. But, uh, uh, you know, it's a challenge because we feed the same areas every year, and we want to catch big alligators. That's the gators that are worth the money. And it's nothing for me to go fill 500 tags and catch alligators like some of them other guys catch a lot of little baby ones. But I want to have a good average because that's what makes your money when you got big ones. And uh, to me, that's the biggest challenge is to keep finding big alligators and keep putting big alligators in the boat, not just any alligator. So is that it? Um, is this as much about a career for you, about the sport, or is part of this uh, more about people and property and sort of protecting those who live near the swamp? Well, uh, you know, I, I make my living doing this. I pay my bills with this. Uh, yeah. I've been doing it for years, long before swamp people came around, and uh, it's something we've always done, but it's a challenge. I enjoy doing it. Uh, it's nothing like catching a giant alligator. I, I would think, you know, if you watch rodeo, you watch them guys ride them big bulls and big Brahma bulls and all that. Yeah. And catching a big alligator to me is like trying to hold on to one of them big Brahma bulls on a string. And, you know, that's, that's nothing like catching a big one. Yeah. You can catch a bunch of little alligators and it's nothing to it. But when you catch one big one, he stands out and you're going to remember that because you better hold on. Well, you got to hold on for more than eight seconds in what you do compared to rodeo. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah. Swamp People set ratings history uh, for history when it premiered in the new season. Premieres tonight at 8 o'clock. Troy, thanks for joining us and all the That's best. That's right, tonight. <laughs> you got it. Thank sir. you. And Take I good want care. to encourage everybody to watch us tonight at 8 o'clock. You got it. Have a great year. Thank you.